Yo, what's going on guys, Korean Tin here, I'm back with a brand new video, today I'm going to show you how to get Career in free mode after the patch 1.34. This is only one for next generation consoles only guys, but before we get into the video, okay, smash like 10 likes, well me a lot, and subscribe if you are new to the channel, so you miss the content that I post, if you're on Android, iOS, space, make sure you a little bit on my channel, so you get notified when I upload a brand new GTA 5 video. Um, but this Career mode and free mode glitch will allow you to spawn, um, props and cards and stuff like that into free mode. Uh, your friends, I don't think your friends can see it, but, uh, let me know if your friends can. And you can be in God mode as well if you're, like, in a different camera view. And you can, um, do this in public sessions. And you can do it in friend sessions and invite only. But, yeah, it is pretty fun, guys. The only downside to this is if you test it out, if you end up testing it by mistake, you will be glitched out and you will, um, not be in creative mode, like, no more. It's pretty vibe that but yeah let's get straight into the video so the first thing you will need to do guys you will need to um hold the playstation button down and you want to switch accounts what you need to switch to your second account you will need two playstation accounts for this and you just want to switch to your second account um once you switch to your second account you want to go to the playstation management section um it's on your settings so you just want to go to the playstation management settings and do that once you've done that you just want to go and to the account management and you want to sign out once you've signed out the account you just want to sign back in once you sign back into the account you just want to um hold the playstation button and sign log out the account once you've logged back into gta 5 you just want to kill yourself as i do on screen and you will see your stamina and everything like that your stats will start glitching out and once you kill yourself your rp bar will go away that will that know when you've done the glitch correct once you've done it, you want to hold start, you want to go to start, and you want to go to online, and you just want to uh, go to the creator. Um, once you've hit the creator, you just want to select deathmatch. Um, deathmatch will work, you can, deathmatch is the only one that's working with this, um, so do that. Once you've hit deathmatch, you just want to hit deathmatch, don't need to go through the tutorial or nothing like that. And you will be in the screen. Now, the only way you'll know if this is working, if there's cars driving about. It's the only way you'll know this is working. And as you can see here, I, uh, I can see my friend um, X80 Proto um, in the game. You can actually see it. And I don't think your friend can see the products, but he's driving into them and you get stuck. But I think on their screen, you they'll be driving through the props. But on your screen, you're, they're driving into them. You can do many things with this. You can like spawn multiple props, make ramps out of it, and stuff like that. As you can see, I changed the view here. And you can, uh, like, change the view and everything like that. You can get killed in this view as well. Your friends can see you, but they can't see the props. Which is pretty bad. It's pretty fun to stroll about when you're doing this. It's like you're modding the game. But, you know, it's a little bit fun. Um, so, yeah. It's pretty fun, guys. I recommend you just try this before it gets patched. Um, so, yeah. But if you did enjoy this video, make sure you do leave a like on it and subscribe if you're on YouTube channel so, so you miss the content that I post. But anyway guys, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace and have a good day. Peace.